update. And welcome all to another excellent edition of the market update at 2 p.m. So what do we have going on today? Well, we went up uh, into uh, the uh, weekend on very light volume and generally not a good thing to do. If you're bullish, uh, we're down 55 points on the S&P cash, which is down about 1.4% on the S&Ps. Uh, everything else uh, pretty much uh, lower. Uh, and, uh, you know, we've got a, a few things going on in the market. Let me... Uh, pull that up a um, few things uh, but kind of standardly if you go up on very light volume into the Thanksgiving weekend or any big weekend generally those kind of uh, rallies fizzle fairly quickly uh, option market makers continue to bet on uh, probably a train strike or something else uh, going south uh, into the 16th and the monthly expiration on options uh, I didn't think, uh, at least coming into this, this morning and actually into Friday, uh, that we were going to do anything but probably have a good opportunity to short on Sunday night and really have risk all the way down into the low uh, 380s on the uh, spies. But uh, Powell talks on Wednesday. I don't think we could expect a lot of people to get in front of that in fund buying. They'll probably wait until to see what he says. Um, for the gambling stocks, uh, they got a pop, although they got a 10-year license to Macau and uh, pop maybe 4 or 5% today like when um, nobody can come to them. So everybody's kind of making some bets out there. Uh, probably way beyond the tips of their skis, uh, that a lot of things are going to happen. And I think more and more, everybody has already figured out that we're headed into recession territory into the first quarter of next year. Uh, and uh, that's uh, pushed a lot of folks, maybe uh, energy, a lot of other things, to start uh, reducing the estimates for next year. Anyway, uh, look for a lower through Wednesday and Powell speaking. We'll be back in a minute for the show. The reality is that navigating financial